apply safe dive practices and techniques like those you'll learn in this course. Scuba diving is a relatively safe activity. Before you get the opportunity to learn new skills in the pool and open water, you'll need to complete a medical self-assessment to identify potential risk factors. If you have a history of one of the listed conditions or you're currently taking medications, you'll be asked to seek the advice of your physician. This medical self-assessment helps determine your fitness to dive. A positive response to a question does not necessarily disqualify you from diving. However, if you have a pre-existing condition listed on the form, you and your buddy's safety may be affected when you dive. There are few conditions that limit or restrict your ability to participate in diving, but diving requires general good health. Areas of the body that are susceptible to the changes experienced by divers underwater include your air spaces, such as your ears and sinuses, and your respiratory and circulatory systems. Additionally, divers need to be able to cope with thermal changes, the optical effects of water, and the mental and physical demands of diving. If you have further questions about your personal fitness to dive or other diving medical issues, Divers Alert Network provides a non-emergency medical information telephone service staffed by dive safety and health experts. This service is free to the public. You can call Dan at 919-684-2948 or in the U.S. and Canada at 800-446-2671. Although Dan Medics will not be able to qualify or disqualify you over the telephone, they may recommend that you or your physician consult with a physician trained in diving medicine. Dan can provide you with a physician referral. From there, Dan can provide you and your physician with the most up-to-date medical information and research as it pertains to your health and safety while diving. Dan is a leader in promoting dive and travel health and dive injury prevention answering more than 15,000 phone calls and emails each year for divers, both experienced and novice. In the unlikely event that you are injured or have symptoms after scuba diving, Dan's Diving Emergency Hotline is staffed 24 hours a day, 365 days a year to provide prompt and appropriate advice about treatment. Additionally, many instructors offer a student membership to cover the cost of treatment for decompression illness in the extremely unlikely event you are injured during your training in an open water or basic course. Ask your instructor for more information. Remember, diving is fun, safe, and affords the opportunity of a lifetime for exploration and adventure. The Medical Self-Assessment Form and Dan give you an extra margin of safety. If you have questions about diving safety or health, call Dan. Dan is your Dive Safety Association.